Carlos Nelson with Cascade Sports. We're here at Van Horn High School at their volleyball practice. Who do we have here? Uh, Nitya Castillo. Talk to our audience a little <laughs> bit about who you are, what position you play, what grade you in, and how long you've been playing. Uh, I'm a sophomore. Um, I'm a DS uh, libera as well. Um, I've been playing. Run that down to them. They might not know what <laughs> DS is. A DS, I uh, play like the back row. So any time a hitter hits, it's like my job to pick it up. All right. Um, I have been playing since my sixth grade year. So who you play for in, in the bitty leagues? Um, give I them just, some action. Give your coaches, <laughs> give your, some of your old coaches some action. Um, I used to play for Nallen. Um, I used to play for Mr. Keister and Ms. Ms. Uh, Hefta over at Nallen. Um, I was actually a manager for um, the volleyball team in sixth grade, but I helped out a little bit more. Um, and then a little bit about myself. Uh, again, I'm a sophomore. Um, I'm involved a lot like around the school this week. We're going to do Spirit Week. What's um, that about? Tell them. Spirit what. Week. Well, since homecoming is this uh, weekend. Ah, uh, <laughs> didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> since homecoming is this weekend, we're getting all like hyped up and rallied mm -hmm. for uh, the big dance. And so tomorrow is Beach Day. All right. Yeah. Uh, with Cascade Sports being home and a student athlete, how important is your education? Very important. It's, uh, I've actually making, been making uh, meetings with the college advisor lately and um, been looking into college tours. How's your season going thus far? So far, it's been going very great. Uh, this season has been one of the best seasons that I have seen this year. Um, we're all very close this year. Not that we haven't been last year, the, but. What's y'all's record? Uh, two to four. Oh, all right, yeah. all right. Who's one of the main rivals? Christmas. <laughs> Christmas, <laughs> and we actually Christmas. play them this Wednesday, so. Uh, you play them this Wednesday? Yeah, here at home. Uh, who's been a major mentor to you off the court? Off the court? In your personal life? Mm, I, w I would say my, my mom. My All mom. right. Yes. My people don't know who they are. Um, my mom, well. What's their name? Um, Fabiola, that's her name. Um, Fabiola? Yeah. Who? Um, What's her last name? <laughs> <laughs> Fabiola Avila, that's her last name. Uh, Fabiola Avila Ortiz, she's. Um, Baby girl, giving you a shout out. Carlos Don Pedro Manuel Martinez, Miguel Perez Don Juan, that's me. I'm shouting out to you too. <laughs> yeah, so um, uh, she's been a major uh, influencer in your life. Yeah, um, anytime that I would be down about a game, you know, she's there to reassure me. They're good days, they're bad days. How important is it for this? This is brought to you by Dollars for You, fundraising you can trust www.dollarsforyou.com Encouragement and you know have uh, not just friends but also peers there to watch um, our uh, athletic community. On a 1 to 10, what's your play been like this season? Um, a 7. 7? Seven? 7, yes. I could she be been making a 7? <laughs> Run it down. <laughs> yeah. Or does she need, to, she need to give you that under the table $5? <laughs> no, she's, 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 she's got a 7. Solo right. seven. Hey, that, 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 that's, that's what's up. You consider you, uh, that you've made uh, good contributions to the team, your team player, and uh, tell me this. With you uh, being a uh, top flight player, how is it when you're sitting on the bench? What does that um, feel like? Well, when you're sitting on the bench, you get a different perspective from the game. And some, it, it, the, your thoughts vary from in the game and outside. So when you're outside, you get more insight on what's happening. And you're, like, more capable of telling your teammates on how to uh, work together. All right, all yeah. right. Who do we have here? Um, I'm Frida Rodriguez. I am a sophomore. Run it down, you know the script. Okay. <laughs> I'm a hitter, so I play outside and middle. Tell our audience what that's about. So, like, basically I'm in the front row, right by the net, so, like, I'm hitting, I'm putting those balls down. How, so, how, how's your season, your personal season, then? Um, honestly, I think I'm doing pretty good. Like, I've been having, like, recent shoulder injuries lately, uh -huh. but, like, I've been, being, I've been able to play through that and... Uh, what would you consider the best part of your game? Um, like, what do you mean? The best part of your game. Like, you, you know, what, what, you know, what, 
do you smash? Do you block? What is the best part of your game? Um, what do you contribute to the team that you think? Do you, you know, you dive on the floor? What, you know, what's the best part of your game? Definitely blocking. I feel like I have some really good blocks. All right. For sure. Uh, who's been a mentor to you on the field? I feel like my mom and my dad. I feel like they've been able to, like, <laughs> my dad is Jesus Rodriguez and my mom's Maggie Rodriguez. Hey, Rodriguez's baby girl, <laughs> she looking at you. She she shouting out to you. You made an impact in her life. I feel like they've just been able to like really like help me whenever like I've been down about certain things, and just like pick me back up again and like They're able to give you some insight. Yes. Yeah. The world is not over. It's another day. The sun shines. Get the get the win the next go round. Yes. Uh, do you leave it all on the court when you uh, out there? Yes. All right. Because, you know, a lot of times I was an athlete. A lot of times you didn't do your best. And after the event, you're like, why didn't I? Uh, I know. I really try to, like, leave stuff like that's going on like outside the court. Because I know, like, when I'm in the game, I'm in the game. And I got to play my how do you How do you feel about sitting on the bench? I feel like you're really able to see, like, what the team is doing and like how we can improve. How, and how, like, how do you keep you? How do you keep yourself engaged in the game so that when coach calls your number, you ready? I try to stay focused in the game by like cheering on my teammates, like helping them to see like where there are certain like areas that the team's not covering and like stuff like that. You looking forward to homecoming? Yes. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Big fun, huh? Yes. All right. With Cascade Sports being home and a student athlete, how important is your education? It's very important to me. I try to maintain like all A's. All Definitely right. want to try to go to college. Uh, you like, you want to try to go to the next level with volleyball and your studies? Yes. All right. Uh, you shouting out? Are you shouting out to uh, anybody? Yeah. <laughs> um, to the team, to, to the mom, team. to dad, to boyfriend, to who? <laughs> what's up? Tell Shout out to my up. family, my all sister, right. Sophia Camila. Hey, Sophia, you heard that. You shouting out. Uh, I'd like to give a shout out to um, again the team and my younger sister, What's um, her name? Kira Castillo. Um, I'm so proud of her. She can run a mile faster than I can under four minutes. Excellent. Yeah. All right, it's a pleasure having you all on the show, and we look forward to covering one of your games this season. Thank you. This is brought to you by Dollars for You fundraising you can trust. www.dollarsforyou.com.